Good morning. Day two, and I'm working my way over to meet up with the boys, Robert, Roger, and Chris, to do a little hunting. Just got into this park and uh, got my first target. Well, low 70, hit 69 once. Let's see how today's going to go. All right, we are starting off with an earring and it's got his backing on it still. So, not really sure if it's a blinger or if it's good. Um, I'll have to get a better look at it. It's got some nice coloring to it that whatever's attached to it here. And uh, it's too dark and my eyes are too darn blurry right now to see if there's a marking, but I'll check it out later. But I have an earring. I'm getting some type of signal underneath here. Ugh, what do we got here? Wow. A flask. Something else under here. And another one. <laughs> How funny. All right, those are pretty beat up. All right, not sure what I'm digging up right here, but I had a 27, and uh, it looks like, that might have been a phone for a second there. Oh, it is a phone. Kinda look like it, wow, that's an oldie. No battery, no cover. I don't wonder if there's anything else in there. There's more. What is this? All right, there's the other part of it. So, wow, that's an oldie. I wonder if they took the uh, battery out and kept it. I don't hear it down here, but that doesn't mean anything. That's, they could have thrown it, they could have done anything with it, but not that I care. All right. I don't find phones very often. This one's obviously been beat down. Probably discarded on purpose. All right. You, you can hear I'm getting... There's a ladder. Pole. Getting a, another signal in the middle of those two. Oh. oh. Wow, another flattened penny. Got a snake on it. Blank on that side. Mm, can't make it out. I know my light's awfully bright. Sorry about that. All right, cool. That's flat and penny number two on this trip. All right, I just found another kid's ring. Um, added to the collection. The funny thing was it blurped, like in the high 30s. Blurp, that's a good word. And then uh, I couldn't get it to lock on it again, so I just started using the pinpointer, and bam, there it came. Little guy. All right, park number two. Got my first target, 42 to 44. I turned the light down a little bit. Plus it's getting daylight out now. I see it. Oh, a mermaid tail. All right, that works. I'm getting a target at the bottom of these stairs here. Just one. So we got 67 ish. Oh, that was easy enough. First try. I have a really nice Chuck E. Cheese coin. All right. Very cool. 
I haven't got a token yet. I think that's my first token. All right. Now I'm with the crew. Roger and Robert and Chris. And we're going to go hunt for a few hours. And we're going to find some cool stuff. Hopefully, Hopefully I find it first. <laughs> Why is my machine talking so much? Look at that. Anyway, whoever finds the best thing buys lunch. Whoever finds the best thing. I know, right? <laughs> All right, I was getting a uh, 42, 43 right here, and this was just below the grass. Um, wow, that's pretty. I guess it's an earring. That is gorgeous. All right, I was digging up a 38 here, and I just pulled up a, a heart. Full of mud in the middle, but there's a heart. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. <sighs> if only I had a heart. Right. All right, so I was digging up a, a high tone, and I got this. I don't think it's a ring. I'm, I mean, I know it's not a ring, but uh, I can wear it as a ring. See? Cool? All right, this was quite the dig. It looks like a button. I can no longer see what was on it. But the back is totally... There we go. Yep, that was deep. All right, I was digging a 45 here and uh, passed through this tot lot real quick. And got a key. Oops, dropped a key. Got a key. There it is. I don't know if you can see that or not. Let me put it on something that's contrasting here. Oh, brown's not the best idea, but... It's a peace symbol. Handcuff key looking thing. I forget what number I was digging. I think it was in the 20s, but... Uh, Got a fishing lure with a treble hook on it. Well, it's only got two left, but yeah. Of course, I, uh, I'm i at the second location and we are by the water, so that makes total sense. Beautiful out here. All right, junk, another jumpy target, and I just dug up. Looks like one of those uh, Boy Scout Awards. Um, some sort of ball, baseball it looks like. But check this out. All the uh, Canadian geese out here. I don't get too close to them, but... Hi guys! They're all chilling out here. Alright, we're at our third and final location probably, and uh, soccer field, and coming around here to hit this really high tone, 85. I can see shiny in here. Whoa! Oh my gosh, that is an awesome find. Whoa, broken um, clasp on the back. Dude, that's probably my best find in a long time. Nice. That is so cool. I don't even care if I find a gold or silver ring today. That made my day. Special police. All right, I had a 13 here and I just pulled this plug. I am not sure if that's a ring or not. Let's see here. I'm gonna say it is. Yeah. Nice. I am having a good hunt here. Look at that. All right, this came up as a uh, pull tab, and uh, I almost didn't dig it. Look at that. I haven't had one of these in a long time. Sometimes the wire is silver, but uh, I don't really care. It's just a pretty cool find. So, Robert over here got himself a nice coin. One of these uh, soccer tokens. Yeah. 2007. Seven, okay. Yeah. Tails. Tails, so they can come out here and they can flip it for who starts. Yeah, nice Congratulations on that. That's an awesome find. Oh, yeah Cool, I got one here coming up as a 85 to 90 So we'll make a little plug here. This is nice soft soil, so it's real easy digging Look at that I'm gonna see if I got it or not Yep 
Look at this. Oh man, what is this? Oh! Look at that! A watch! <laughs> Pretty cool. Probably had a leather band that's long gone, or who knows. Broken there, broken... Man, I don't know. You know, it might have been one of those that just has uh, a little loop and it's on a chain. But, uh, pretty cool find. Alright, this was a really deep target and it was really sketchy. And, uh, it's a penny. But I believe it's a wheat penny. Yep. Nice and deep out here. I don't know what year yet, but I'll check later. If I can even see it, it's in pretty bad shape. But heck, what a hunt. This last place turned out to be really good. I'm not really sure what I have here. Just pulled up the plug on a 37. It looks like it's just a washer, but it's connected to something. Oh, okay. Huh. What's that say on that? Not really sure. Interesting. I was pulling up uh, 82, and I thought I was pulling up a uh, dime, and uh, it's not a dime, that's for sure. It's a pendant. Wow. Hard to tell if that gloves on here. Okay, that's got some sort of design on it. I bet that's silver. That high number. It's got some type of possible writing on the bottom or scratches, I can't tell, but that is in good shape. I don't see a lot of rust on it or anything, so there's hope. Um, I will clean that up and uh, figure out what I got. This time I thought I was digging up a quarter, and I see a coin, which like a... I'm not really sure what I got. Oh, FIFA. That's been down there a little while. You got some damage to it. Bummer. All right, I got a nice target here in the sand. It's 70s, 80s, and 90s at one point. Close to 80s and 90s now. I smell a toy. Please be a toy. Oh yeah, I kind of figured it would be. Yes. Mm, yeah, baby. Got me a nice car. The cool thing is, this is my last hunt, and uh, I probably won't do the wrap up till I get home. So look out for Christine to be in the wrap up. That'll be a fast car for her to drive. Very cool. Maybe I'll find more. Right, I'm getting a really uh, jumpy signal here. Yeah, that's it. All right, let's see what we got. Garbage under there. Ooh. Whoa. It's all knotted up. I got a chain with a cross. Dang, that's nice. I'll have to detangle it later, but yeah, look at that. I always seem to get a chain at least one while I'm here in the Sacramento area, so at least I got one. However, it's just bling, I can tell. No no one has precious metal that looks like that. But heck, that's a pretty cool cross. All right, I was uh, pulling up, a, well, I thought it was going to be a penny, right around right 60. And I see a flower, so it's definitely not a penny. And the rings continue to flow. Yeah, I'm all wet. Getting all dirty here, but yeah, got another ring. I'm not going to try to clean it. I'm just going to throw it in the bag for now. But uh, heck, I think that's ring number, I want to say three on this video. So I'm not too shabby. It's probably one of those I told you about on a previous video where you get a lot of these rings with the thing on top broken off flowers, hearts, or whatever. So this one is intact. All right, I'm getting all so dirty, but uh, I just found this in this clump. You can see the flat spot on that. I'm not even sure what it is. Square. 
Probably came off of something. It could be a label or something, but can't quite make it out. All right, this is pretty cool. I pulled the uh, plug up, and as soon as I did, these two coins dropped out. Two quarters under there. At least I think they're quarters. Yep. That's awesome. I don't know if that was it or not. Get the shovel out of the way, and we'll nose around a little bit. Look at this. Whew. Not it. There's another one. Penny tore up. So this soccer field was packed yesterday. So the whole reason I came out here was to look for surface finds. And I found none yet. But uh, I mean, I did get the couple things in the top lot, the car and the chain, but uh, and that little ring in the grass. But this is uh, I dug down here. It came up in the 70s, like a it's going to be a uh, dime probably. But it looks like part of a car. Yeah. Still trying to get it out or not. Oh yeah, I got the shell to a car. I don't know if the rest is down there. I don't feel it or hear it, but I got the top. All right, this was a uh, apple core. Who's your friend? Um, sorry, right on the sideline here, I got this and it's in pretty bad shape, but it's some type of a uh, pin. Probably soccer related since it might be a soccer ball on the top. Anyway, it doesn't look salvageable, but I'll still try to clean it up. But cool find. Maybe. Maybe not. Alright, I am heading back to my truck and cutting across a field and I had a 50 right here. And look at this. There's a chain. I don't know how long it is, but... Whoa. I just bling, but all right. Wow, it's got a clasp that's broken here, so it might just be a bracelet. That's what I'm thinking. Wow, that's pretty cool. I'm sure it's just bling, but I will still clean it up and get a good look at it. But heck. Probably one of my last finds here. Like I said, I'm just heading back to the truck. I'll try one more location because things are starting to dry out. But uh, that is a nice find. All right, I was digging up a 77 right here and I assumed it was gonna be a dime. And I'm thinking it's a car. Well, again, it's just the top half. Anyway, you just never know. I will clean that up as well and get a good look at it. By itself. Yeah, it rang up a strong 77. I'm back. Finally. <laughs> There's an alarm going off. Anyway, my final. What are you doing? My final yeah. Sacramento area hunt is a finished and the wrap up is upon us. Do you want to go and grab that? Nah, it'll keep, keep going. It. Off. Okay, all right. Okay, so I have some very interesting finds. Number one, I've got the most wow, metal. heavy duteous tent stake ever. Um, you can sure tell the stuff I've dug up out in the fields versus like a top lot that I don't sometimes hunt. Mm -hmm. Anyway, check this out. Batteries. It's oh like, no! It's like me, hollow. <laughs> That's messed up. Here you go. For you. It's... Brought you back a car. That's it? Well, here's a better one. Mm. And a better one. I got two hollows. Oh no! So sad. Is that crazy? Poor things. How does that even happen? All right, we all want to know it. You must show it. Do your thing. Yeah, that's so weird. That's weird. Drum roll. Yeah. There you go. I like that. Now, you can't do those because there's no motors. They're MIA. <laughs> anyway, um, 
So, we finally solved the mystery of Jurassic Park. This is the phone that the dinosaur swallowed. Remember he swallowed a Nokia? That's Motorola, but it just looks just like that. And here he is. Blah. That's actually a Pokemon. Oh, he doesn't stand <laughs> up though. Boom. It's like me, face plant. Anyway, moving Dude, on. Those kids won't even know what that is. Yeah, that's an old one. Um, got a button with nothing on it. I have a fishing reel. Oh, that's what that is. Yeah. Wow. Um, zipper poles. More fishing tackle. A treble hook, which only has two of the pieces. One you thought it a park? There was a little pond near it, so people fished. Oh, God. Fishing weight. Um, key. Batteries, battery. Mm -hmm. What are you doing? Let's see. Oh, I got part of a um, bicycle or motorcycle chain. Oh. All kinds of rusted stuff that I got up. Uh. Really? Yeah. I had to grab them. Look at him cute. Look at his little arm. Look at his little arm. Oh, no. Okay. Oh, Look at his. Oh, <laughs> my goodness, buddy. His little nailies are all. His I just cut mine. It's your turn next. His little clawsies. They're so long. Anyway, back to the hunt. Mm -hmm. You sure can tell that I've worked the uh, soccer field in grass That's a lot. disgusting. They look like poo poo. Yeah. A lot of little pieces, too. What else? You got some knobs. I got some good change. One, two, three, four dollars and fifty cents there. Um, one, two, over three dollars there. So over seven dollars and change. I did not want to sort out all the pennies. Um, there's a lot of pennies. Gosh, when you are in county right now, you remind me of that, um, intro song from one, two, three, what is it? One, two, three Happy o'clock. Happy days. Yeah! <laughs> one, two, three o'clock rock. Yeah. Like that. Yeah. Whew. Anyway, back, now we get into the kind of interesting stuff. I dug this up. Very interesting. What um, is it? I don't know. Okay. I, I can't read it. I'm blind. Is Yu-Gi-Oh. What? Yu-Gi-Oh. Okay. I have a Chuck E. Cheese coin. Sweet. This is a soccer pin that is in bad shape. Oh, wow. That will never be recovered. Oh. I have a watch. Oh, my gosh. This piece fell off of it, the cover. Oh, gross. Yeah. I found a heart. Oh. Um, a scouting, uh, one of these little words they get that goes in your belt. Mm. Um, oh wait. This was kind of a cool find. I don't know if it's an earring, but it's abalone, I believe. You're full of baloney. Yeah, it's an earring, bro. It goes like this. Baloney was my first name. No, his first name. Somebody's first name. My baloney has a first name. Oh yeah, that's it. I forget these things. What's his first name? Oscar. O S C A R. Yeah, Oscar. My baloney has a second name. Meyer. I know this. Okay, this was not on video, but I found that little thing broken off something. Oh, Same with this. Mm -hmm. It's part of a clasp to a probably a necklace or something. Yep. I got a buddy. Stop tapping. I got a fishtail. Woo. Mermaid. This oh, one here. Ducktails. This duck one here tails. says high desert. Ooh. And that was in a soccer field, so it's probably something related to soccer. I don't know. Is this a ring? I don't know what that is. I'm going to say yes. It's bent, though. It's really bent. Obviously. Okay. Wasn't really sure. But I got a um, FIFA token that's in really bad shape. FIFA? FIFA? Yeah. FIFA, FIFA, FOFA. I've got a key, handcuff key. Peace. Oh, look at how cute it's so tiny. I know. That's ironic. I have a uh, snake to flattened penny. Can you tell what that says? I There's should... a snake in my boot. All right, buddy. Get on. Oh, she's looking up the snake. I've got a uh, another stone that's all wrapped up here. Sea Quest Interactive Aquarium. 
Oh, it's an aquarium. Cool. Um, four rings this time. So I've got the rings. I keep going with rings. Look at this, Christine. Three kid rings. This one was in the um, dirt, like an inch or two down underground. I popped up the uh, plug, and there yeah. it was. These two are um, at the park in a tot lot, and I, I didn't. Love the blue one. That's cute. I didn't film it though. It's cute. But check this out. This one was in a soccer field. It's another one of these with the cross and the um, the writing on it. Mm -hmm. Really pretty. Spanish or English? It's Spanish. Wow. Espanol. Country. So I now, the then country. I got this. I got that in the middle of a soccer field, and I thought it was really cool. It is just bling. You can see the discoloration. Gold wouldn't do that. So cool, though. Then this was in a tot lot. Got a nice cross. Wow, that's beautiful. Yeah. But the grand finale. Earring. Check that out. That's turquoise and silver with a backing on it. Wow, that's so sad. That's beautiful. Then, at another field. That is really pretty. Oh, I hate it when people lose really nice stuff. St. Michael. Ooh. And it says sterling on the back. Dang, this is cool. Oh. That's really cool. Um, both of these, I tested them when I got back, and they both tested positive for silver. So I scored two silvers. Dude, I like this. Isn't that pretty? Yeah, it is. Oh, that's really cool. Yeah. But the most exciting find, even though it's not really valuable. Yeah. Did you just pocket my earring or my St. Michael? No. Lies. <laughs> liar, liar, pants on fire. Maybe. Check this out. Wham! Special police. You can wear that. Wear it to work. Do you know why I pulled you over, Meow? Did you say Meow? <laughs> <laughs> Buddy can wear that. That'd be a Halloween costume. No, I didn't next say year. that, meow. <gasps> Ow! I think with these four rings, that probably puts me at uh, close to twenty-five rings on that trip. I understand that most of them are just blingers, but wow, absolutely wowzism! Wowzers! Wowzers! Um, just go ahead and pan to Buddy. To show how he's impressed. I'm not. Buddy, are you impressed? No. Buddy, are you impressed? No. <laughs> <laughs> you like that? <laughs> anyway, stay tuned for the pinpointer update. Dun, dun, dun. Yeah, we're going to update them on the pinpointers. We'll make a point about the pinpointers? We'll point the pinpointers out and point, make a point, yes. Yeah, okay. <laughs> okay, bye. Bye. Ma'am, <laughs> confess. <laughs> this is a pinpointer confession. I thought you were going to say just the facts, ma'am. <laughs> just the facts. What a missed opportunity. <laughs> Story of my life. <laughs> All right, so we have an update on, I'm gonna make a point right now on the pinpointers. No one has come forward on either pinpointer. What's the point you say? <laughs> I'm just kidding. But seriously, no one's come forward to claim the prize. So as a result- Nobody? Nobody. I'm just very close to my face. Um, as a result, <laughs> Um, we are going to give you guys another opportunity to win the pinpointer. Both of them? Yes. No, nobody means both of them. Okay. So, <laughs> you will have one week to comment on this video. Right? No. No? Comment on this video and we will draw... <laughs> no way. The two, so in, the two new names. Yes. On for the following so video. In a week. In one week. From today. Oh my god, we gotta start over. <laughs> 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 Never mind. We'll keep going. We'll power through this. Listen, Linda, it's not that who's on first? Let's <laughs> on second. Okay. So, so <laughs> wait, let me try this. I can do it. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, 
Okay, so in a week, one week, we're going to draw two new winners. We're going to draw two new winners. So <laughs> and how are we going to pick them? Comment, comment on this video. And in a week, we will pick two winners. Based on the comments on this video. Based on the comments of this video. This is why people use cue cards, for real. <laughs> Your comment can be anything you want it to be as long as it's G-rated. Yes. And uh, we'll draw the names on Tuesday night so I can edit it for Wednesday morning in exactly one week. <laughs> yeah. It's not that hard. <laughs> you have not seen me at work. <laughs> oh, goodness. Anyways. That's the point on the pinpointers. I hope I've made my point well. I'm it took good. forever to get to the point, I'm but really I got there. I'm really confused. So. Do you want me to do it again? No, I got it. Let me recap for you. Watch this video. <laughs> like it. <laughs> Click the button that says like it. Make sure you're subscribed. You don't have to be, though, but it'd be nice if you were. <laughs> and then make a comment. And then in six days, we will... Draw a win two winners and post it on the seventh day. Ooh. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Yes. <laughs> Did you see I got confused? I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> yeah, because we have to edit no, wait, the video no, on yeah, Tuesday like, for it Wednesday. It comes out in the morning, yeah. You, there's no way. Again, who's on first? What's on second? The stuff we put up with. <laughs> the stuff they put up with. Why are you guys watching us? Make sure you subscribe. <laughs> or run away. <laughs> I would run away. Yeah, bye. Okay, bye. Uh -huh.